Yeah. How do you explain Leviticus 11, 1 through 7 that talks about uh, how you can't eat pork, can't eat shellfish, anything, you can't eat anything that does not chew the cud, mm -hmm. have cloven hoof, and does not split the hoof. You can't you eat any fish of the sea that doesn't have scales or fins. Uh -huh. so that means you can't, eat, you can't eat lobster, crab, any kind of mollusk, you can't eat pork, you can't eat like badgers, but that's that was just a random, I don't know, I was like, there's like a big long weird list of animals. I don't know, I mean, I guess badger's like a delicacy or something. I've never tried it. All right, my understanding is that those food laws God gave the Israelites for two reasons. First of all, in Leviticus, the whole point is God is holy. You're to be separate from the countries around you. You're to be holy. And these laws are ways that you are going to be separate. And secondly, those food laws at that time was a way of protecting the Israelites from diseases.